Richard, can you describe the Obsidian range of funds? And Royce, could you describe how they differ from their peers? Um, Andrew, we've got uh, uh, four focused funds. Um, the objective of Obsidian Capital is to, to, to remain focused. Uh, so we have one long only balanced fund. It's a, it's a Reg 28 compliant high equity fund. Um, we have one equity long only fund, which is in the general equity category of the, of the unit trusts. And then our two hedge funds are our flagship um, Obsidian SCI multi-asset hedge fund. And then our more equity centric um, Obsidian long short hedge fund. Andrew, I think whilst the, the legal structure might be very similar to our peers, I think the background to how we get to the end result could be quite different, um, principally driven by the fact that then we have no external shareholders. So um, the investment team are essentially the, the owners of the business, so there's no external influence, um, which does give us investment flexibility. And secondly, we, we, we have a, a, a material amount of our own money invested in the funds. So we're not just custodians of a brand. Um, we actually live and feel the upside and the downside of the investments, um, as do our investors. So we very much, um, in our opinion, align um, with the investor with the investor result from a from a investment uh, perspective. 